Hey guys, Suzaku7 here, and welcome to a new Let's Play. Now, I know I just did Shining Force 1 as a Let's Play just recently. I just finished it, but, but you're probably wondering why am I playing this again. Well, um, there was a certain person on YouTube that I saw, and I was like, let me look for some more Shining Force hack games, because the last hack that I played was Shining Force 2 Battle Royale, which was made by Nightshed. And it was a long time ago since I played that, and that was my favorite hack game. Now I discovered this one, and I know I'm gonna butcher your name, the one that created this hack. Um, he goes by Erikin? Erikin? I think that's his name. He's the one that created this hack. It's a Shining Force 1 hack. And this one's called Shining Force Alternate. So, and also the person I want to thank, I'm sorry if I forgot your name. Actually, I'm going to look it up right now since I am live streaming. I'm not regularly recording this. So, there's a person on YouTube that I looked up and I was like, let me see, let me check this out. And I looked at a little bit of like gameplay, just a little bit. Didn't see what too much was going on. And by the way, this is going to be a blind let's play. Um... And it intrigued me because it has some new characters in here. As you can see, this scene right here, that's from the Shining Force CD. That's a Shining Force CD thing. Um, you see some extra little characters here. Alright, so the person that I, I'm going to give thanks to for this patch is... Kellifman? 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 Maximum Gamer. I, don't, I know you got your first name wrong, but you know who you are. I'm going to thank you very much for the patch you gave to me. And actually, when I looked through Shining Force Alternate, um, not a lot of people have actually played through this game. There's only maybe like a handful of people that's actually played it. So similar to Shining Force 2 Battle Royale, there wasn't too many at the time when I did it. So, we are going to Let's Play Shining Force Alternate. Now, let me... I guess a little explain of what Shining Force Alternate is. I have honestly no idea, honestly. Really, I don't. I, I'm gonna assume, I'm gonna take a guess that this is gonna be a parallel universe where there's gonna be characters that normally wouldn't join your party that are gonna join you in this game. And maybe some characters that joined you in the previous Shining Force 1 game probably won't join you at all. I'm just guessing. Because there's a reason why it's called Alternate, but We'll see. I mean, Shining Force 2 Battle Royale didn't have a specific story mode. I don't know if this one will. If it does, that'd be very interesting. So... Yeah, there's the name of the person that made this. Erikin. I'm sorry if I got your name wrong. A female swords... Huh. So Max is female in this? That's interesting. Alright, wow, let's... She looks like, um... That girl from Shining for CD with blonde hair, but this one has brunette hair. Alright, so I'm gonna name her... Suza. Short for Suzaku, without the ku in the end, so it's just Suza. Just, that sounds like a girl name. So far, the story's the same right now. Alright, there's Lord Various. Yeah, we know about that. Whoa, look at my character. It's long blonde hair. I mean, brunette hair. Whoa, this is weird. Wow, this looks pretty good. So we got Lord Various. I don't know if he's a lord in this one, but his sprite looks a little different. Alright, hold on, let me look at my inventory and see what it looks like. What the hell? Oh, so the creator is actually in the game, that's kind of cool. So he's in my advisor, that's what it says. And the weapon, so the inventory looks a lot different. Alright, Lowe's gonna show up, yep. Whoa, his portrait's different. That's cool. I'm actually gonna read the text a little bit here. Because a lot of stuff's new. Oh, 
Uh huh. I like how your character talks back, which in Shining Force, the remake, um, Dark, Re you know, Resurrection of Dark Dragon, your main character does talk back, but in Shining Force 1, he never usually, he's usually a sign protagonist. Sir Various, so he's not Lord Various, huh? Oh, he is Lord Various, what the hell? I think it would be really cool if Varys joins your party, because I think that'd be so awesome. Wouldn't that be kind of weird? <laughs> so Lo looks exactly the same, just his portrait looks different. Yeah, so, alright. Let's see. Whoa, what the hell are you doing here? Okay, that's a Shining Force 2 sprite. Huh. So he's the preacher, huh? Oh, look at that. That's cool. Alright. I'm gonna really check around here. Can we get items? I have no gold. Oh, wow. That looks a lot different. All right, Gort, are you up here? Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Oh, you can't do the glitch here. I guess they got rid of that one get person. So I guess we'll go up here. Wow. That was this this was never here before. Took May spot, huh? Alright, got those guys. Let's go up here. King's model looks pretty interesting. I mean, Sprite, and there's Nova right there, and the right. And the left, I guess, is our, um, our new advisor, is Nova gonna join our party? That would be kinda cool. Actually, since I'm live streaming this, I might as well look on the chat and see what's up. I don't think a lot of people's online right now. I mean, it's pretty early. So, all right, let's continue. All right. Nova. Oh, your voice sounds a lot lower. <laughs> Anything over here? Who's this? Oh, it's May. She looks. Wait a minute. She has two feet. You look completely different. Huh. Alright, so let's see uh, how many people. Aleph? Wow, we get her early. And there's Tal, and then is that Diane? Oh, it is Diane. Wow, we get her early too. Hello. Has formed the Guardian Squad. What the hell? <laughs> okay. 
Oh, you gonna join us too? You're the advisor. Various does join. That's cool. I'm really curious to see what he's gonna look like. I think I'm gonna like Various a lot. He's gonna be so unique. I'm liking this already. I just started. This already feels different. 400 coins, huh? Um, hang on. We got somebody in the chat here. We got, uh... Winters, where am I? <laughs> well, you're here at the uh, stream. This is the this is a Shining Force hack game, if you were curious. Um, this is called Shining Force Alternate, which is an alternate um, parallel world of Shining Force 1. Everything is like what-if scenario. So I got a different cast of characters here, besides the low. Um... Characters here. Huh. What is that? Is some type of potion? Alright, so let's get Maxim uh Magical Elixir. I'm guessing that's the restore MP. That's my guess. What is that? Is that a vest? Where did I get that? Alright, let me get a couple of these. Uh, yeah, my character. Alright. Can I equip that? Yeah. Okay. Alright. They just vanish. Okay. Alright, so this looks the same. Oh, they actually talk during it. Looks nervous. Okay. Hmm. Wow, he has a character portrait? Well, we get some Shiny Force 2 sprites, by the way. <laughs> That's interesting. Alright, well... Let me look and see what characters are done. Speed this up. I'm gonna keep the ma uh, the text on, I mean, the battle message on. Alright, so we got the map. Alright, so various. What do you got? You got magic? Charge. What does charge do? Alright. My character has aggress. Makes sense. Uh, we got Blaze. So she is Tal of this game. Of this one. I don't know if we get Tal later. I have no idea. There's Low. And then there's Diane that has also magic. It's called Aim. I don't know what that is. Okay. I'm very curious to see what this character is going to look like. Huh. They move just like the one in Shining Force 1. Alright. Uh, Alright, let's see what you look like. Whoa! Wow! He looks really cool. <laughs> That's the coolest looking sprite I've seen of a centaur yet. And these Shiny Force 2 characters look good in the Shiny Force 1 field area. Alright, this is our main character. Female, Max, basically. <laughs> Alright. Alright, what does Blaze look like in this one? Does it look the same? Oh, she looks pretty cool. 
So the me battle music's the same, which it should be. What the hell? He can already shoot that far away. One damage. This guy's pretty weak. Huh. Alright, Diane, what do you look like? Oh. Trying for a CD spray, huh? Well, the good news is, since I'm live streaming this, I mean, I don't have to worry about stop recording or anything like that, because I'm recording this right now. I can use this? Hmm. I don't know what that... What does this do? What does this actually do? It heals you. Oh. And Lowe's model looks pretty cool, too. I just should have noticed that right away. I like his model the most. God, Lee, dude. Various looks so awesome. Alright. Uh. Why not? Three damage? Not bad. Very weird to see. It's very, very weird to see Shining Force Two in, uh, enemies in a Shining Force One game. I just did the Let's Play of Shining Force 1, and now I'm playing the hack version of Shining Force 1. But this one intrigues me right now because everything feels different, but it's still very much Shining Force 1, just with a lot of different characters. that as a spell? Like, I use the item, but then I use it like an actual spell. That was kind of different. Level 2 for Diane. Might as well do where I name all the levels. Crazy that I'm playing as various in this game. Okay. Um. When am I gonna level again? I'm gonna keep my character right there. Actually, you know what? Let's see if this actually restores MP. It says. Magical elixir, so it should restore MP. It does. That's going to be very useful.
the hell he didn't attack? That was, uh, kind of odd. Alright, let's lure these guys down. Very dangerous to put him up there. Hey, what's going on, Hoodie J? I'm playing Shining Force. Um, it's called Shining Force um, Alternate. It's an alternate game. Everybody's going after. Yes, it's a mod. Um, to explain myself how to make this into what it is right now, um, I'll explain it in a second. Hang on. Alright. Who's that? Ernest? What are you doing here? Whoa. Killed off Ernest, huh? Interesting. Whoa. It's still playing the cavern theme, even though I'm in the field right now. Kane? What are you doing, huh? Why are you here already? Okay, I was gonna say. <laughs> All right, let's see who we got here. Oh, look. Rune Mage. That's the only new enemy. Well, look at this area. It looks so different. Oh, I forgot to get Gong. Oh, damn it. I usually never forget how to get him. I'll get him after this battle's over. I'm gonna get going. Who's the main character? It's this girl right here. Yes, female version of Max. So it's an alternate world. I call her Suza. Since, you know, my name on here is Suzaku. So Suza for female name. Very weird to hear the cavern theme in a field area. All right, let's get Gong here. Oh, there's Gong right there. serious right now? You're not gonna join us? Huh. 
Come on. Oh, Joker's not out here. There's the priest. You can't help me. I wonder what level you get to be promoted in this game. Is it still level 10 or is it level 20? I don't know. Alright. Glad you're back on YouTube, Suzaku. Been watching your old videos currently on Shining for CD. Shining for CD is a great game, by the way. I was gonna actually play through that game next, but then I found out about this hack. And I was like, I really wanna play this hack. I know it's been a long time since I haven't recorded any Let's Play before I did Shining Force 1. I just... I just haven't been feeling the Let's Play spirit at all, really, until recently. Because I love Shining Force games, so... It was always make me feel like I want to come back. But so far, I'm, I, I'm very intrigued by how good... Um, I'm not gonna butcher his name again. Um, Arakin. He did a pretty great job, I mean, to put all this together. You should do a walkthrough on this. Well, I am right now. I mean, this is a blind. Let's play. This is blind. I've actually had never played this game before. I've never, ever played it. Oh, look at the field. Okay, that looked different the way he did that spell. I would like to see more people play this game, this version of the game, because not a lot of people know about Alternate at all. I mean, actually, the person that made this, he just recently finished it, so that, maybe that's why nobody knew about it. You know what? This thing, this guy's gotta go first. Wow! A deadly attack, that was nice. Well, that worked out the way it should. I love the way this person actually made like the areas that when you fight, it's really cool. I think the final boss is probably going to be Dark Dragon, but it could be something else. You never know. This is a hack after all, so I have no idea. What does charge do? It's only a sideways attack. Huh. Alright, low. Since he has. Well, he could probably get killed. It. No? Apparently not. Oh, damn it. Yeah, Aleph has Blaze, which is really interesting compared to Bolt. I wonder if she'll actually learn all three elements. Right, I'm trying to get my character to level up here, because well, level one. There you go. But the main character's attack is very much like Shiny Force CD. I love the way Lowe's design looks.
Yeah, I can't wait to see these characters promoted. See how they're gonna look. Varius looks like the coolest looking centaur in this game, man. Ooh, nice. Double hit. I wonder if there's counterattacks in this one. That was weird, he zigzagged around. That was some nasty damage. Oh, he didn't go after the kill. Huh. Well, that was odd. Alright. I got some healers that can heal her. You need a level bad. I like, real bad. Hold on. Oh, wow. That's some reach right there. So it's just extra range just for the magic spell. Oh, interesting. Okay. I love these an I love these animations that this guy did. He did a really great job with that. Oh, she's level three already. Learns freeze, all right. I learned freeze already. Wow. I think that's big. That's really a game changer that's restoring P like this. Ass damage, man. Wait, what the hell is that? Why did it have two squares? I've never seen that before. That was weird. I've never seen that before. This got really interesting real fast. I 
Let's use freeze. Didn't even do anything, that was weird. Oh, of course you're gonna use your spell. I think I'm in trouble. I think my character's gonna die. <laughs> Cause the thing is, I don't know. Like, I don't know, like... It seems to be harder than the original game. Oh, he actually leveled. What does that do? Okay, I'm dead. I knew I was gonna die. So it hits two targets. Huh. Hmm. Hmm. Huh. Oops. Well, well, you got to see myself die in the second battle, which that doesn't happen. But this is a hack, so I didn't really know like how the enemies were gonna move. But I usually luck out and get out of those situations, but that didn't happen this time. Well, considering some of you didn't see me die in Shining Force 1 at all, that's what it looks like when you actually lose, you just start over. Plus, I'm under leveled, by the way, so that's why I'm dying so easily. I knew I was going to die, I really knew, because when I live stream something, it tends to go backwards. But I didn't want to do a regular recording of this, I want to just show you everything. And there's no difficulty change in this game. I don't know, like, I really don't. So, uh... Hopefully I won't die again anytime soon. Cause that's great, I shouldn't have died at all. But I lost Varius, because I think he's a heavy hitter even though he's level 1. But I know better not to die like that. I'm usually really good at not letting my characters die at all. And I'm surprised they didn't tank low there. <laughs> and he didn't. Wow. Well, Varys is level 1, so that's why he has very bad defense. can't level. And our weapons are really, really trash. <laughs> They're so weak. Alright, level 3 for Diane. Strongest character, honestly, is Aleph. She's level 3 and she's doing a lot of damage. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna get various set kill. And I don't know why I'm doing physical attack with this guy. 3 damage? That'd be 1.
I'm trying to get Varius to kill that mage. Okay, you finally went to level two. Huh. I can't afford to die again, man. This is ridiculous. This is getting way too out of hand. This is actually feels harder than Shining Force 1 does. Like the original game, this feels harder. Like, I have to really protect my main character at all costs. Like, I can't afford to let this character die again. I didn't think the second fight I would die. You know, it's just ridiculous. That's just some nice damage. After this thing, because this rune centaur is way too dangerous. Huh. Does that move again? Oh man. Alright, get rid of this thing, get rid of him. I need to do that. I am putting my main character at risk too much, but I need to get her some experience. Zaka gotta go, but keep the videos up after you're done recording. I'm gonna watch it later. Yeah, this isn't this isn't gonna go anywhere, dude. This is uh gonna be archived right away. Well, 
You're gonna be a sacrifice, but you know what? It needs some damage in you. Interesting spell, it just extends the hits. I like that. So this heals you too, huh? Physical attack, huh? Huh? This. I still don't know what charge does. Oh, you're gonna move back now, huh? How many experiences do we have here? Finally over, god. Whoa. Captain May, huh? She's a captain. Alright. Let me safe state here, since I am streaming. Let me do that real fast. Because I usually safe state. Um. Okay. Weapons, arming, sword. Thank you. 
Tomahawk. Iron Arrow. do have to manually equip, which I was hoping they would do the auto-equip, but then it's trying to pursue, you know. But Lo doesn't need to attack, though. Oh, he doesn't join you. That's... Huh. Look at all these dead soldiers here. gets killed instead of various various had to watch that. Ship has joined, has been formed. Huh. So they're officially joining my party now. Okay. Alright. Any treasure chest here? Oh, wow, it actually transferred to other characters. How about that? How about that? Man, that's very useful. Because in the original game, you had to have one inventory for any character. Now, if some people miss this live, don't worry. This will be archived immediately once I'm done. But I want to live stream this game because it'll make it a little easier. So I don't have to do it manually, you know, and edit all that stuff. Power one for myself. One by one. Protect the milk. 
gonna use it on myself. My what? Oh yeah, what happened to Ken? Oh, is that him right there? Huh. Hmm. I'm guessing we just leave, huh? My bats. Oh god. We should try to avoid them to reach the. Oh man. Not these guys. I hate these guys so much. So. We can't kill them? So I have to completely find a way to ignore them. I don't. So it's the race against the fin. It's a race to the finish, basically. Which is odd in a Shining Force game where you just don't fight them at all. Alright, well, I'm gonna have to protect my character then. They're everywhere, though. Shiny for seat. Wow. One shot. Always keep coming back to life when you kill them. Oh, that's very annoying. Wow, that's very annoying. Oh, that's gonna be annoying. I gotta get rid of one of them at least. I don't get a lot of experience out of these guys though. Oh, they get an extra turn. How about that, huh? Oh, you get poisoned. Oh, that's great. Not only, so they don't put you to sleep, they make... Oh, that's... That's annoying. That is very annoying. Why do these guys get double turns? I haven't got a turn yet. So I don't have an antidote. Oh, it takes three points off. Oh, man. Oh, my God. I'm gonna hate this battle so much. Not only that I'm poisoned, I gotta find a way to avoid these guys. Wait, what does this do? What is this? Wait, what?
the hell is that? What did that just do? Learn Blaze level 2, wow. Okay. Killing these guys are really pointless because they're going to keep coming back. There's no point. There really isn't. Use this. Oh, that looks kind of interesting. Okay, go after them. Don't go after me. Giant bats have always been annoying. They're not hard to kill, other than they can dodge a lie, but. God, dude, would you give me a turn already? There's too, there's way too many of these bats. There's way too many of these guys. Level two, why not? Man, it's just it just keep coming, man. They're not giving me another turn. It's just one bat after another getting another turn. They're getting double turns. They really are. Because I haven't moved yet. Finally. Alright. Get out of here. Jeez. Ugh. That was annoying. There's probably gonna be more battles like that again. Turtle dust? What is that? What is turtle dust? Alright, I'm gonna give that to her. I have no idea what that is. Magical elixir. All right, that'll be good to have. I'm gonna give that to Blow. My Shayla. Wait, who is that over there? 
Who's this? Okay. Oh, there's more of those, huh? doing here? Why is he here? He's a pass. What's the pass for? To get in the castle? Let's go to Elixir again. Arming sword. There's another sword. I want to sell this though. I don't need it. Let's go elixir again. I'm getting a lot of these. This is good. I'm actually poisoned, by the way, so I need to find a way to cure my poison. Huh. So I can use it on the fly, which is interesting. I can't believe I died earlier. I usually don't die in situations like that. bread increases my HP another magical elixir wow I'm getting a lot of these Wait, who's this guy oh he's a portrait huh so he seems important so 
over here. Interesting that these guys are pink and they're the Shining Force 2 sprites. It looks interesting. Protect milk. Quick chicken increases your agility. I know the chills for bread. Wow. This right here. 100 coins. Chill for bread on myself. Protect milk on myself because I need everything possible to make myself better. Quick chicken on myself. Okay. Burning Staff. Huh. Try to give that to... Um, let's give that to Lowe. Can Lowe use it? He can. Okay. I don't know what the hell Burning Staff does. Inside me, the name's broken. Huh. Okay. Interesting. I'm guessing you're gonna be gong, right? Hopefully we get the Circus of Rindo theme here. Should be. Hold on. Let me give him some items. Oh, I got another chill for bread I didn't even use. Oh, he's got some items, actually. Alright, hold on. Let me use that. I'm going to use it on him, because I just got him. Let's see what it is. Alright. Kane, again. You're not gonna fight. No, there's no way I'm gonna fight him already. We'll get some new enemies. What the hell is that? I've never seen him before. I gotta fight this guy. Maybe. Hang on. So we got our new character here. Broken. 
Rockin or whatever how you say his name. So he's a heal blast. So I'm assuming that move with Aleph was called blast, and we got slow. His weapon is a backpack. Okay. All right. So we got Pegasus Knights. We got this guy here. 50 HP. He's got a heat axe. Oh my god. So he's the marionette, basically. He has way more health than the marionette does. That's way too much HP in the early point. That's early in the game. I know it's a mod, but still. That's crazy. Whoa! He looks very different than Gon. <laughs> oh my god, three damage, really? Three damage is all you can do. Yeah, seven, that's better. What is that? Does it do anything? What does this do? What is this? Oh, it's Blaze! Oh, wow. Low has that spell ability now with this weapon. So you can actually fight back. I got Blaze level 2. These guys gotta go first. It's gonna be crazy. Alright, let's see what you look like when you fight back. Huh! Oh my god, that's great. Actually uses an actual backpack. That's crazy. Three for various, he needed that one bad. Huh. Level four for Di Diane. You're healed. Healed up. So now Low can actually fight back. That's kind of cool that Low can actually use magic. Actual MP, which is crazy.
Oh man. First dodge. At least my strongest character right now. This free spell is very strong. You know what? Let's use charge. I want to see what this does. Okay. Hmm. That was a nasty damage right there. This guy. Still got the turtle, whatever that does. I'm gonna save it actually. Oh, there we go, this move again. Good damage right there. All right, um, do I finish this guy off? Oh, oh, nice double hit. I can use charge. Wow. That 
didn't do very well. They really go. They really like going after him. She's probably gay here. Surprisingly, she's not dead. Oh, here we go with this move again. I forgot, I can use spells with this. It's so interesting, I can use magic. Those detox. All right. Okay. Um, the last level, level one. What the hell? He brings out a one. Okay, that was different. Oh, you could have saved that. And fight. Come on down. Alright. Whoa. This guy looks like he's from straight out of Golden Axe. I did one damage to him. That's not good. That's not good. That's not gonna cut it. Could I do something with this? One. Oh god, what is this? What is he doing? damage right there. I think magic might actually... That looked really weird when she cast that. Varus will probably get killed off, I don't care, because he really can't do anything. I think after this battle, then I'll take a break on streaming, because I've been streaming for a while now. Go ahead and use blast. Of course, his health went back up. That's how most shining force bosses are in shining force one. Uh oh, I have to separate my characters next time. Oh my god! See what this does. What does this do? What does this actually do? Decreases defense by 10, so I might actually do a lot of damage to him. Alright.
Nice! That's even better. Two damage. Wow. Holy crap! Wow. That was a lot of damage I just did. <laughs> Alright, come on. Finish him off. Don't miss. Okay. Well, that actually happened a lot better than I thought. Level 4. Is certainly interesting. Uh, we got Gunner GG. Yeah, I'm actually playing this. Uh, I was curious to see what this was. Not a lot of people's actually play let's played this game. There's only been like one or two other people, so I felt, hey, let me try try to play this. What the hell? So she doesn't really join you, she's just kind of there. Huh. it for chapter one. I've only seen one guy do so, yeah. Yeah, I've already died, actually. Apparently, I've already done the second battle, which is kind of like, because I didn't know what I was doing, even though I'm better than that not to get myself killed, but... Alright, let me go ahead and get these weapons here, and I'll stop the video soon, or if there's any new weapons here. Nope, everything's pretty much the same. Now, is there any hidden characters, since you've probably seen somebody else play, is there any other new hidden characters in this game? Anybody that I should know about? Oh hey, what's going on? Um, Erican eighty eighty four. You're the creator of this. That's really cool that you actually showed up on here. I know I'm sorry if I get pronounce your name wrong, but uh Hey, how's it going? As an expert on this hack, huh? It's 
It's good to see you on here. I there hasn't been too many people that's actually let's played this game. There's only been maybe one or two other people that's actually played it. And I know you just finished this about earlier this year. I did read your thread on the Shining Force, uh, um, you know, website forms and all that, and I was like, hey, I'm very intrigued by this because I like the way you actually make these characters, and um, I like how Max in this alternate world is a female, which is kind of interesting, and. Um, I see that you put your you put yourself in here as an advisor, so I'm I'm assuming you're going to be playable. You're going to be playable at some point because you're on here. I'm just taking a guess, really. Well, it depends on how bordered you want to use the word hidden. Okay, so he's not really playable. He's just kind of there. All right. All right. Um. Let's see. I do like the fact that you actually did a different job of like putting like the the bats battle in the first chapter. You have to like run away from them instead of just killing them off because they'll constantly respawn. So that's almost like you're taking that from uh, Fate of the Emblem of Justice, where you have you know, mission base where you say, avoid the enemies, and then sometimes kill them off, so... Because I play Fate of the Injustice, it's a really good game. Um, let's see, oh yeah, it's just got the speed ring. Uh, let me give that to... Let me give him. So how long did it take you to actually finish this hack? I um, would assume it took you about a couple of years, a year maybe? Damn it. Okay. Oh, wow, this guy. Edmund, is that you? Your portrait definitely looks like Edmund from Shining Force CD. And it's also interesting that some of the characters that normally would join you don't join you in this game, like Gort, um, May, and all them. So it's cool that Varys is playable. I, li I like that a lot. Okay. I do like some of the items that you can actually use as spells, which is pretty cool. Well, yeah, I'm, I'm going to enjoy this hack a lot. I liked Shining Force 2 Battle Royale that was made by Nightshed a couple of years ago, and I loved that. It didn't really have a story, but I like how this one you added story to it, where they made it a little bit different. So that made it a lot more unique. Um... So you started in last year around March, okay. Eleven playable characters. That's it. There's only eleven. There's not thirty or anything like that That's kind of different hmm. I also like how the characters actually interact with each other instead of just being Nova just telling you about what you need to go and also your main character talks too, which I like that. I think my favorite character from what you've done is actually, I love Varys' battle sprite. It looks amazing. It's probably my favorite battle sprite for a centaur. And I absolutely love this character's design a lot because when he's in battle, he throws his freaking backpack. I love his animation. At least he's not a gong clone, even though he's kind of just like gong, but he uses a backpack. I love his animation a lot. He brings out the wand and starts healing. So those two right now are my favorites. Although I like Aleph a lot. Like her, her um, battle spread is really cool. So all right, let's see what we got here. Oh wow, Golem's already early in here. Huh? Okay. Swordsman. 
Elf mercenary, huh? And of course, we got the zombies. I'm gonna have no big surprise that there'll be enemies popping up here. Because this looks wide open to be having nothing here. So, um, alright, so I'm gonna end off this stream. I've been streaming for a couple of hours, actually. So I will come back probably Monday or Tuesday. So I will stream this again. I'll do part two. And um, I'm just going to do the entirety of like chapter two at this point. But um, I'm going to go ahead and save state because I need to. So I don't have to do all that other stuff again. All right. So uh, let's see what's going on here. I've always hated having to choose between certain characters and with uh, this one the cast. You can focus more on them. Okay, that's good to know. That's good to know that the end game doesn't work, but... Um, I'd like to see other people actually play this game, just besides just me. I mean, there will be other people catching on, like, to play this, because when I played Shining Force 2 Battle Royale, at the time when I did it, not a lot of people let's play it until years later. I started a lot, started seeing a lot more people. But this one is a newer hack compared to, you just finished it this year, so that's why not a lot of people know about it right now. But I do want to see more people play this, because this is very interesting. My first impressions, pretty outstanding hack. It's one of the better hacks I've seen for Shining Force yet. And I like a hack like this that's unique, has different characters. Like, you have various join your party. Just an alternate, that's why it's called alternate. I just like something that's fresh and different. I don't want to play a hack that has slightly different stat boosts, slightly different characters. I want... A majority of a big change like Battle Royale did. That's why this one intrigued me. I was like, this looks really cool. So, alright guys, so I'm gonna get off right here. So, I wanna thank you guys very much for watching this. I know there wasn't a whole lot of attendance right now, but hopefully there'll be a lot more by the time I play this. But I'm glad that, um, um, Erican, um, actually showed up here. The creator that actually made this hack. I'm glad you're actually on here. So, expect a lot more of this later on. And, uh, but yeah, um, so I will see you guys later. Peace out.